Pedro Galese and Wilder Cartagena make their first appearances in front of a partisan crowd, while Gabriel Pirani is rewarded with a start, having scored off the bench against Cincinnati. The ball is kicked into play, Orlando City and DC United wrapping up their season series at Inter and Coach Stadium. Alongside World Cup veteran Lori Lindsay, I'm Eric Krakauer. Game being taken, Araujo attacks it! Oh! And from close proximity, Orlando seemed to have scored the opener. It was Schlegel popping up, ghosting in, but the flag quickly raised. We need to clean up those areas, and we've seen it as of late from Orlando. Much more combination play. Big shoulder from McVeigh, but not big enough. Thorlson puts it back. Oh, Hannah! Martin O'Hara slamming that one into optimal velocity. Oh, great work on the right hand side from Doug or Don Thorholson. Work from Thorholson. He's the one that provides the direct play in behind, the rotations between him and Torres. Torres is the one that occupies the wide areas. That allows for Thorholson to be able to get in this position. And then just the presence of mind, the composure to be able to cut it back, bait McVeigh and then get his head up, find the pass. We had just mentioned the execution in the final third. Well, it's all Thorholtzen in this moment. That's an excellent pass. And then Ojeda, first time, does the rest to find the back of the net. And Orlando City up 1-0 in the first 20 minutes of this game. Martin Ojeda justifying his inclusion in the 11. Swung in towards the penalty area. Thompson made contact. So back in Orlando possession. Cartagena Hayatsen! Oh! The big Swede wins the dog fight in the clouds. And Orlando City have doubled their lead. But then you get Torres, just time and space, no one steps, everyone's just dropping. And then this is a, just an excellent ball, just whipped in. But again, too easy defensively, taking nothing away from the goal from Janssen. I mean, what a beautiful header that is. Just redirects it to the far post, tucks it in right underneath the crossbar. But too slow to step out. No one really touched tight. Herrera trying to come over to help out defensively. What a beautiful header that is. Put them up 2-0 here at home. An immaculate delivery. And across the six in the back heel from McGuire. An impromptu move that didn't seem too far away from target. Well, Rodriguez, not to get himself, there's plenty of targets to aim for. To Rodriguez, who lifts it. Oh! A coming together of three players cleared off the line by Janssen. At a distance, that is, because they're nowhere close to these Orlando players. And over. Torres, looking for options. Squeezes through to Angulo. Here's Ojeda. Angulo gets a touch, Angulo! Into the empty net! And Orlando City are running away with this one. They are rampant! Three goals unanswered. Starting on the right side. Going out the left side, Torres, Ojeda involved in the play. Lazy defending from DC United. And then you get the little runs, sitting on the back shoulder of the defense. And then the little gut pack ball, because that darting run opens up the space in behind. There's Ojeda trying to get the ball in behind. His run draws the attention of the defenders. And then Agulo just finishing up underneath. All he has to do is side foot it to the far. Won't arrive that soon. Agulo with the lane. A goal brought down, oh no! This is a calamity for DC United, who will now surely be down a man. That allows for Angulo Torres to pinch in, and then it creates these overloads. And then you're forced to chase even more because no one's stepping, no one's communicating, and, and that is a close call because it does look like it is outside the box when the initial challenge is made. Okay. Torres with Angulo as an option. 
That's weighed perfectly. And Gulo with Ojeda. Ojeda with the strike, and that one just fizzes over. <laughs> so close to making it a clean sweep. Ojeda. Schlegel! Tipped away, Janssen at the goal mouth. First, Maguire released to Torres! With a goal at his mercy, he makes it for an absolute clinic. Unselfish from Maguire, who rolled out the red carpet. But it's DC United trying to work the ball up, and then this is what they, they risk. The space in behind, Duncan Maguire, always the willing runner. Had been frustrated previously, wanted to get some of the balls in behind, but this time just gets his head up, picks out the right pass, and what weight is it's perfectly placed to that far post. Easy tap in. Miller's trying to come across, defenders coming in. So Lodero swings it in near post. Freeman wins it! And it's Ramiro Enrique. Who heads it into the back of the net. A manita for Orlando. The substitute with the first of the campaign. Pieces, corner kicks in particular for Orlando City. Comes off the near post flick. Enrique in the right place at the right time. Continues his run, just splits Penteke. But once again, it's just too easy, unacceptable defensively for DC United. These are the areas that you can control. This DC United team started this game and they were in their preferred 3-5-2 formation. Well, that's it for this one. As the curtain comes down, a statement win from Orlando City.